Hey everyone, it's Lobster Shorts. You've probably noticed I haven't been around as much lately. I have been exploring other crafts that I really like, like sewing, and I have not been doing the paper crafts as much. Also, my craft room is a nightmare mess right now, so we're putting up some shelves hopefully this weekend to get it organized again, and then I should be right back into it. In the meantime, I'm gonna show you some other things that I've got off AliExpress that I've really liked. And the first thing I have is this bag of knife rests. This came in a pack of six. Knife rests are kind of hard to find here in Canada, and they are also really expensive. So I did find these little metal dog ones off AliExpress for fairly a good price. Again, there was six of them in the bag. I haven't tried them yet, but their little feet do seem pretty sturdy, so I don't think they'll have any problem balancing the knife and fork on there. But I thought that was so cute. They're just these little puppies and again they have their little feet to balance it out so that was a pack of six i will be posting the links for everything below next thing i have is this kite i have bought a few kites off there and i had this gigantic octopus kite it was like eight meters long and it was really cool it was such an impressive kite and it was hard to get off the ground. So you had to fly it on a bit of a windier day. But the one time I took it on way too windy of a day, it ended up getting wrapped up in a huge tall tree in a park and I just, I couldn't get it down. So unfortunately I lost the kite. So I bought this one, which is a little bit smaller. And I actually think I am going to re-buy that great big octopus kite. But I thought this one would be fun in the meantime. This is another soft kite. I think you call them parafoil because of the opening. So this was a trilobite kite. It's a little bit on the small side, but it did get off the ground really easy. It also came with this kite string. And it has these nice long tails. So it does look pretty cute when it flies. And again, this one does get off the ground fairly easily, but you do need a steady breeze to hold this one up. But I thought it was cool. He looked fun in the air and I had fun flying it. And let me show you my absolute favorite thing that I have ever bought off AliExpress. I was very skeptical that this would work. So this is a tiny little metal detector. It, I think it's called a scuba detector or something because it's waterproof. You can use this underwater. I thought for sure this was not gonna work but it did and it worked really perfectly. So it's this tiny little metal detector. It's like the length of your arm. It's very small and again, it's waterproof. It also only takes the nine volt battery and I was wondering if it would eat the battery really fast, but it didn't. So this thing worked great. We used it snorkeling and it was a lot of fun. The one thing is um, it does after a bit turn itself off so you have to keep checking that it's still on so I would just like like run it over a ring and if it beeped or vibrated I knew it was still on so you can hear it beeping under the water but it does have a vibration setting so you'll know that it's on and you won't have to worry about hearing it under the water not sure if I mentioned but we took this snorkeling and it was so much fun the battery lasted the whole time Actually, the battery hasn't run out yet, so it was it was just fantastic. I absolutely love this thing. I was super into it. It's waterproof, worked perfectly, loved it. And that is all the things I have to show you guys this week, so I will see you next week.